everyone and welcome back to my channel today is another week of house videos and also I have a lot of information to share with you so um first off let me put some my phone okay so um the first thing is is that uh my refrigerator so I just went to Lowe's I actually did a lot of shopping today I got my couch I got my tv stand from Ikea, I got my couch from my family's furniture store that they own, and I also got um, a rug from there for my living room, and I got a, few, a couple of furniture pieces from Target. I got a um, what's supposed to be a console table, but it's actually a desk because they didn't have the console version of it in stock, but it literally is the same thing except it just doesn't have a rack underneath the desk part or whatever. I got a bookshelf that I'm going to put in my um, office but you'll see all that once I move in because it's all packed away and I'm planning on doing more videos on those but that's just the update and then I just went to Lowe's and also um, my granite countertops got done today and I am so excited to show you I cannot wait to see what they look like I went to Lowe's and got a bunch of things for my sink like all the plumbing stuff and the faucet and everything and a couple of other things from there like some shower things and stuff so let's go ahead and see what the countertops look like today because they got done <gasps> oh my gosh y'all look at how beautiful it looks <gasps> oh my gosh oh my gosh i am so excited they look so good i'm gonna show you the whole thing oh my gosh they look so good like look at how beautiful I can't wait to do like a before and after um and then they actually like rounded out that side of the corner which is so cool because I don't think it did that the last time but I ended up getting just a single basin sink and they went ahead and drilled the holes for my faucet to go in and my soap dispenser and it looks so good I love this like um spot that has a bunch of gray in it and then this little area right here also i don't think i mentioned this when i was in the garage but um all of my appliances are coming thursday but my refrigerator is on back order right now so i'm having to wait but that's okay because i have the refrigerator out in the garage that i can use so i could move in without the refrigerator um if i can so that is what happened today but also what happened was um, she started putting the trim and like measuring it out. And um, I also got, I think I already showed, I got internet, or no, that was Friday. So I did get my internet in. So I have my internet all over there in the corner and that's gonna be hidden behind my couch because of the way the house is built. There's nowhere in like the middle area for there to be like one of those cable lines that are right there. And the only ones I have are in my bedroom or in uh, the living room. And you needed one of those to be able to have internet. So I'm having to, um, I'm having to put it behind my couch because if I were to, I really would like to put it somewhere in the middle of the house, but the, um, there's nowhere to plug it up and hide it really very well and so um, I just have to hide it behind there and also it's the best place it's the closest we can get to the middle of the house where it'll go throughout the whole house um, internet wise but also if you notice there's like this little um, walkway I've shown this a bunch of times um, to the first bathroom and there's like no light right here so I'm actually planning on putting a plug-in down here and then doing like a motion light like little night light kind of thing there because there's literally no light in here and there's a closet so I have to turn this light on in order to see in the closet at night because there's no light coming through here besides the bathroom light so because the hall light is up in the back of the hallway but yeah that's something random about my house but pretty much everything is pretty much done besides a few spots of paint like there in the corner um needs to be painted there's a few spots that still need to be painted and then the door knobs need to be put on and the all the cabinet doors and hardware and stuff needs to be put on um but right now she's just working on 
the trim around everything. Basically, that is the update here. It's just my counters. Oh, I can show you from this angle. They look like from this angle, and you can see how they look on here. And then these are actually, I ordered these off of Amazon. I had to order uh, my shower faucets from Amazon because they, um, because of them not having the color that I wanted at Lowe's. And then I also got this little thing that I found at Ikea, a super cute that I can put like cupcakes and stuff on. Okay, that is all for today. Um, we are inside the house for this little segment because since everything is pretty much almost complete, there's just a little touch-ups that are happening. Um, I decided just to film in here because I didn't really know um, what is gonna be done in here, but because there's just like little touch-ups and things and I should be moving in. I was thinking I would be moving in this weekend. However, we'll probably have to push it back one more week, but I for sure should be moving in that following weekend, I'm assuming. I'm pretty sure though, because everything is pretty much almost done. It's just a few little tweaks and things that need to be done. So I'll show you what she's did, done today. We went around and I noticed that she, I think, well maybe not, maybe she didn't um, do this, but you can see how the this part of the wall is different than that part of the wall, which needs to meet all together. And then, um, we, I didn't show this yesterday, but my dad helped me put my faucet in, and I'm actually gonna get a new one of those because it's so yellow, but um, I put this faucet in, which I am so obsessed with. It's so nice and pretty, and it comes with a little soap dispenser and my countertops and my sink. Um, we still have to put the disposal in there, but once that's all done, it'll be good, but she primed the edge part of this wall and is finishing up all of that. Uh, no, she hasn't done that yet, but she still hasn't done the um, this little wall that's right here that needs to be painted. She hasn't done that, and then she hasn't done the bottom trim of the shiplap wall yet. Um, and I'm also getting my door for my front door actually came in um, yesterday and it's going to be put in next week which is why um, I won't be able to move in until the following week maybe I don't know we're going to see how we feel about that but anyways there's like a little bit of stuff that still needs to be painted from the previous color um, let's see and then see this piece right here still needs to be painted and let me look and make sure I don't want to like oh that's really bright um, yes, and all this wall still needs to be painted um, in the bathroom. And the wall right here still needs to be painted. All right here needs to be painted. Um, and then my toilet still needs to be put in. Oh, also, I don't know if I, I think I mentioned this yesterday in yesterday's post, or yesterday's thing, um, but my closet space... So this is what my closet looks like. I've showed it a million times. I'm obsessed with it. It's beautiful. But um, I think what I'm going to end up doing because Ikea right now is so is like sold out of every type of closet organizing, organizing uh, every type of closet organizing systems that is what would fit in here and everything is all sold out. So I think for right now until I can get a, um, the one that I want and everything. I ordered one of those like clothing racks that are on wheels. Um, and it's like, has a rack up on the top and then on the bottom. I ordered one of those on Amazon that I'm gonna probably put on this wall and then leave this wall open and then put my dresser that I have right now from Ikea in the back of the wall and then just put like my jewelry and stuff up there. Um, for now and keep it simple and easy because I don't want to put like an old like a um, shelving like a uh, clothing rack thing like we had before in here because I don't want to bust the walls or anything like that and I don't want to like drill anything into the walls because I'm planning on doing that with my Ikea stuff so I'm going to keep everything just simple and easy right now and then once I can get the Ikea stuff I'll change it to what 
I'm wanting to get, if that makes sense. Y'all, I am so obsessed with my countertops right now. It is crazy. I am literally obsessed with them. They look so good, even though there's a bunch of junk all over this, but they look amazing and I'm so happy about them. I still need to like wash them because there's like stains and stuff on them from it being outside. Yes, it looks so, so good. I am obsessed with it. It just looks so pretty and I can't wait for the doors to be on everything. Okay, anyways, I will talk to y'all tomorrow when I have a little bit more of an update. Okay, so it is Wednesday now. I'm gonna go see what she did today. Um, let's go look. Oh, watch out for that. Um, she painted, I think, this wall. I think she might have fixed, let me see. Yes, she started fixing the thing that I was talking about over here. And then all behind my faucet is all painted. And then she fixed the little piece that was down here. She painted the um, spot that was right there. Yep, that's everything. Okay, I'm back at the house today. It's Thursday and I actually got all of my appliances except my fridge. So let's go look at them. Um, I actually have already seen them today because I came over here earlier. Um, hold on, let me set my stuff down. But this is my dishwasher. It's a Maytag dishwasher and I love how the buttons are very sleek and minimal and you can and there's not like a massive handle. The handle is like underneath this thing. Um, I need to like take all the like plastic off and everything and honestly that's like the best part of everything is ripping up all the like peeling all the clear coats and stuff off of everything. Um, this is like it says please remove the protective coating. I can take that, oh, there it is. Please remove the protective coating. I can take that off. Um, ooh, yes, look at this, it's so satisfying. Oh my gosh, that is the most satisfying thing ever. I feel like I'm opening up a new Apple product. Um, and then we've got this one. Oh, they're all sticking to my hand. And that one. And I did, um, I have it half of it is um, all digital and then the other half is like the little dials and um, I've got this and then um, I love this handle on here. This is also a Maytag. Um, I just love it because it's just so, actually it's turned on right now which is cool. But um, yes, I love this and I'm going to put cute little rags there and stuff and be like a little old lady. It's going to be so fun happened oh this is my microwave but i have to put it up myself like my dad's gonna help me though um but this is my microwave it's a maytag as well and it kind of matches this but it's very sleek and minimal and it's gonna go up above the um uh, stove and then i have my fridge is coming actually next week so i have to wait for that because they have to um, ship it from a different store because they're completely out of the fridge that I have been wanting. But anyways, there's that. And then, um, let me see. Ooh, she finally painted this edge piece um, that's on the side. Oh, and then here are my lovely washer and dryer. I'm very excited about them. They need to be cleaned. They're a little dirty. Um, and I actually ripped off. There's like a sticker all right here that I need to rip off. But I ripped off the sticker earlier today. Um, it's just this simple Samsung um, white washer and dryers, which I'm obsessed with. Um, and so, yes, I'm very, very obsessed with these. They look beautiful. There's a fly. Excuse me. Can you please leave my house? Thank you. Um, but yeah, I'm thinking of putting something on top of them, like a table or something, or something that rolls, um, 
to like almost like a folding table or just something where I can do like a cute little thing up there with all of my stuff for the washer and dryer like my detergent and stuff and little jars and things I'm super excited about that and then I'll just use these for storage for when um I have stuff that's up there that like I don't need to touch as often because I'm going to need to get like a step stool or something to reach those now but that's okay we will make it work yeah so anyways that is the end of this week's video I will talk to you guys next week when I'm hopefully moving the following weekend I thought I was going to move this week but um I have to push it back at least another week but yeah so I will talk to you guys in um next week's video bye <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.